Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from In Motion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Google Apps Wizard in cPanel. All right, begin by logging into your cPanel. If you don't know how to do that, a pop-up will come up on the screen. Go ahead and click that to go to our full guide on how to log into your cPanel. Once you log in, we're going to scroll down to the email section and click the Google MX Wizard button. The Google MX Wizard is going to really simplify the process of creating MX records to point to Google. For example, if you want to host your email there. You can also manually create your MX records. If you want to learn how to do that, a pop-up will come up on the screen. Go ahead and click that to go to our full article on how to modify your MX records. But in this case, we're going to use the Google MX Wizard here, which really simplifies the process instead of having to manually create the records. So in step one, we're going to click the drop-down box here and then choose the domain that you want to create the MX records for. When you do that, it's going to provide some additional services here on the bottom. Check any other additional services that you also want to set up. In this case, I'm just going to set up the MX records, so I'm going to go ahead and click Continue and Configure the Domain with Google Apps. When you do that, a pop-up will come up on the screen. It actually says, are you sure you want to configure the domain with Google Apps? Click OK to proceed. At this point, it will create the DNS entries and it will list them all for you. Essentially, you would have to create these one at a time if you didn't use this MX wizard. Once you see the Go Back to Step 1 button out here on the bottom, it's already created the records. Go ahead and click it. It will take you back to the main Google MX Wizard page. You can click the cPanel button to return to the main cPanel page. And at this point, your, M your DNS entries have been created. And keep in mind, it may take some time to propagate, possibly up to 24 hours to for it to propagate globally. For more information on propagation, a pop-up will come up on the screen. Click that to go to our article that provides additional information on propagation. Thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Feel free to like this video or comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.